I'm Jack Facetti, and I'm into the puppetry, what they call marionettes. This is with strings attached to the stuffed animal is what it actually is. And you move them and operate them by control bars at the top. I've been in this for years, and I go all over, and I'm doing it as well as teaching it to different ones. Now, in the puppetry world, there's two different lives you live there, one through your eyes and one through the people's eyes. When they watch and see, you can watch the expression that comes over their face, how they smile and how they're happy. And the other ones, you can actually make people more happy in everything you're doing. But yet today, people are taking marionettes and using them in different ways for different types of entertainment. With this one here, it's strictly to entertain maybe children all the time. What you can do, you can take stuffed animals that you have, you can attach strings to them and to the top with crossbars and you have a marionette instead of giving them away at all times. Well, back in 1934, I saw it. it was the first time I watched a puppet show. And I was really amazed how they was using the marionettes and controlling them. And I thought to myself, I'd like to learn how to do that and control and manipulate a small monkey on the end of a string or different things like they were doing. And from that time on, I got further into it and further into it and up till today, so today I'm still doing it and getting mastered it today into different ones, making my own and coming out with different things. Locally, I got involved with Farmer's Market here in Manchester Center. And since then, I've been there every Friday for almost four years, every Friday from 10 until about three. And there we help the children make marionettes, puppets, and do different things down there. And they're getting more and more involved in everything we're doing, and it's helping them, okay? And then I have other puppets, what they call vent puppets, and those puppets I actually designed for children and everything else. They're handicapped puppets. And the reason I did that is to show children, if they're out playing with a lawnmower, throwing rocks and different things, they can lose an eye, they can lose an arm, and different things, or get hit by a car. They need more of this going on all over the place to be able to show children handicapped puppets. But today, most of them frown upon it because they said it offends them in different ways. But yet, I have all these puppets and I still can show them down at Manchester when I go there. Nobody says anything. They seem to enjoy to find out how to have safety cap awareness at all times. And that's what we're after. Say handicap and safety and abuse, what drug abuse too, watching that and various things like that that come out. 